welcome back to our stupid rap sheet. It's Corbin. I'm Rick. Uh, today we got some stand up comedy. Who's making us laugh today, Corbin Miles? Is it your mom? Um, yeah, maybe. Sweet. She's maybe. funny. Yeah. No, this is uh, read, read, uh, read this. This is a clip from Rohan Joshi's stand up special, Wake and Bake. Rohan Joshi and Tanmay Bhatt are two of the four founders of AIB. Tanmay Bhatt posted this combination of clips on his channel as a tribute to Rohan, who inspired him in his toughest times. This is the only place where I could find all the clips in one video. The stand-up's already subbed, but Tanmay's message in the beginning isn't, so please get the first 1.5 minutes of the video uh, subbed. Yeah, yeah. We got it. Uh, enjoy. Cool. All righty. I already have a feeling. Well, I'll say it at the end. You might forget. No. Yeah, I might forget. No, I won't forget. Blame it on Rohan. Aaj main aapke sath kuch share karna chahta hu. One of my best friends Rohan Joshi uska stand up special hai Amazon Prime pe iska naam hai Wake and Bake. Bahut badhiya special hai. Usi ka clip aaj main aapko batana chahta hu lekin is special ke baare mein main kuch kehna chahta hu. Kareeban 1 saal tak mujhe clinical depression aata tha aur main ghar se nikalne ki koshish karta par ho nahi pata usse. And I think maine bahut time tak kaam bilkul bhi nahi kiya kyunki mere andar ek dar sa paida ho gaya tha ki main khud pe kuch kar sakunga ya nahi. Kyunki pichle 10 saal mein maine Rohan Ashish Khamba ke sath itna kaam kiya. कि खुद पे दोबारा चालू करना इट जस्ट फेल्ट सो स्केरी आई डिट नो मुझे बहुत इम्पोस्टर सिंड्रोम टाइप हुई थी जब सब इतना सक्सेस आ गया लाइफ में कि आई फेल्ट लाइक आई डोंट नो इफ दिस इज बिकॉज ऑफ मी इफ आई हैव एनी केपेबिलिटी ऑफ माई ओन इसलिए बॉम्बे छोड़ के मैं बैंगलोर चला गया था कुछ महीनों के लिए बिकॉज इन माई माइंड आई वॉज लाइक मैं शायद अभी मीडिया इंडस्ट्री में कुछ करने लायक नहीं हूँ रोहन का स्पेशल शूट हो रहा था उस दिन मैं बॉम्बे आया स्पेशल देखने और स्पेशल देखने के बाद मैंने रियलाइज किया कि इवन इन आर टफेस्ट वन ईयर आई सो माई फ्रेंड रोहन ही ग्राइडेड आउट ही डिट गेट वॉक डाउन बाई एनी ऑफ सोशल मीडिया प्रेशर वो रोज जाके स्टैंड अप किया उसने एंड ही मेड दिस अमेजिंग स्पेशल और वो देखने के बाद आई फेल्ट एक्सट्रीमली इंस्पायर मुझे लगा कि यार दैट मे बी इट्स टाइम फॉर मी ऑल्सो टेक द लीप एंड स्टार्ट डूइंग थिंग्स ऑन माई ओन हि स्पेशल बेक इन बेक Amazon Prime पे रिलीज हो चुकी है जाके देखिए and I just wanted to do this uh, for Rohan. I hope you guys enjoy the special as well. See you. I'm 36 years old. Sometimes I see young people like Eva doing things, and I'd be like, holy shit! I wish I could still do that. But then I remember that I am 36 years old, which means fuck you, Eva. I have money now, so I can do that. <laughs> that is all your 30s are, by the way. In case anybody's wondering, it is just your 20s, but with more comfort. Because you actually have financial stability. <laughs> I'll give you an example of myself. A couple of months ago, I was at the store and I was trying to choose: should I buy the PlayStation 4 or the Xbox One? PS4 or Xbox One? PS or Xbox? And suddenly, this voice in my head goes, "Rohan, or <laughs> you're 36 years old." And I was like, "Yeah, fuck, holy shit, I'm 36 years old." So you know what, Eva, with full swag. I went and bought medical insurance. <laughs> yeah. But there's some stuff that I used to think I loved doing when I was young and in my twenties. I thought I loved doing it, but I realize now that I was only romanticizing my poverty. <laughs> One of those things that I thought I loved doing, but will never do again given a choice: driving road trip from Bombay to Goa. I would love that. Fuck you. Tum log jao. Uncle play mein aayenge. Yeah, we're in Sacramento. I get you now. Thank you. But that's the only in Sacramento. They like San Antonio to El Paso. Nahi hoga meri gaadi se. Sorry. Nahi hoga. And it's really difficult because the problem is, right? I feel like in every friends group there's that one fucking friend who wants to drive everywhere. Like just wants to drive everywhere for no reason. Can't turn anything into driving. You either go up and be like, bro, my sabzi leke aaro. Bro, sabzi chhod Manali chalte. Hey. Also, road trips are damn fucking overrated. In India, especially, because first of all, road trip ke liye road hona chahiye. <laughs> Second of all, every road trip has the same graph. If it's a 12-hour road trip, the first two hours are wow, what beautiful scenery. The next 10 hours, by mistake, you light one cigarette, and it's like, oh shit, nikalne ke pehle hagna chahiye tha. Bro, kya hai Manali? Kitna pyar 
ಅಂತ ಇದ್ರೆ ಗಾಡಿ ಸೇ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಕಾಂಟ್ ಡೂ ಇಟ್ ದ ಡ್ರೈವ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಬಾಂಬೆ ಟು ಗೋವಾ ಟೇಕ್ಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ವ್ ಅವರ್ಸ್ ದ ಫ್ಲೈಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಬಾಂಬೆ ಟು ಗೋವಾ ಟೇಕ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಕಾಂಟೆಸ್ಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಆಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಕಮ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ವ್ ಅವರ್ಸ್ ನೇಮ್ ಒನ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಕುಡ್ ಫಿನಿಶ್ ಇನ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ಯು ವುಡ್ ಡೂ ಫಾರ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ವ್ ಅವರ್ಸ್ ನಾವ್ ಐ ನೋ there are young people in this room <laughs> which means there's definitely at least one smart ass dying to shout sex <laughs> sex and do for 12 months <laughs> I am 36 years old. 12 hour sex sessions are not aspirational they are science fiction. Like <laughs> my age you hear a song come on that says I want to make love to you all night long like chal jhoothe. Young people in this room you will not understand. Tum logo nahi samajh mein aayega but you don't understand how weird it is to be at an age where you relate to the questions in the ask the sex expert column. tum log nahi samjhoge it's damn awkward because the only time the sex part column ever comes up is when somebody wants to laugh at it so your friends are reading out the question like <laughs> and i'm like <laughs> answer kya <laughs> okay good for i thought we were done and i wasn't happy about that having a kid in 2019 is fucking mad expensive like i have a nephew and i see how hard my sister and her husband work to make sure that there is always enough money to give him the best of opportunities to send him to the best school possible and i know for a fact that he goes to the best school possible because every single morning when he wakes up he does something really weird he goes to it willingly <laughs> as someone who was raised in the indian education system <laughs> do you know how weird it is to see a child wake up at 6 in the morning and be like yes cool <laughs> same same in la it makes no sense to me but then again my nephew goes to an ib school right yeah it's a really good school it's an ib school do you guys know what an ib school is no right for those of you who don't know ib is short for bada hoga india mein rahega <laughs> goes he goes to an ib school i went to an ssc school again why <laughs> like ib and ssc it couldn't be two words more different than that all right like it's not that ssc is shit in comparison to my nephew's education ssc was shit in comparison to the choices he <laughs> had <laughs> Because when I was growing up, there was ICSE, CBSE, SSE, Indian Certificate of Secondary Education, Central Board of Secondary Education, Secondary School Certificate. उन तीनों में से सिर्फ मेरे education में education word नहीं था. CBSE kid SSE kid right plane goes to 15000 feet ICSE kid is chilling in business class CBSE kid is in economy class SSE kid is crying in cargo <laughs> go up high enough door opens time for the exam ICSE kid gets a parachute CBSE kid gets a parachute SSE kid gets a textbook about parachutes <laughs> That was a smart comparison. 
And then they kick us all out of the plane. <laughs> ऐसी ऐसी सीधी ऐसे के बच्चे मस्त पैराशूट खोल रहे गोप्रो वीडियो ले रहे ऐसे ऐसे का बच्चा बस गिर रहा है पैराशूट इज एन ऑब्जेक्ट थैंक यू हिमांशु वेरी मच वेरी फनी वेरी फनी वेरी फनी वी डोंट हैव there especially in 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 general education there's there's basically two things right or three things there's, there's three things here in school there's public school and that that's all run by the states so depending on your state it could be better than the others and then there's private schools i guess charter schools would also be in there but the charter schools fall into the category of private yeah they're kind of private yeah. school so uh, private schools it's basically if you're a certain religion that you want uh, basically taught as well or it's just a really nice school and yeah, it costs and you're a lot wealthy. of money. Yeah. yeah. And then there's public school which is obviously a free thing that our tax dollars go to and it, it, depending on where you are in the city and what state you are in Correct. depends on how good the education system is. And the is. number of kids per class so in a private school you're going to have less kids per teacher than you would in the public school and what you basically have comparatively is the people who would be at the bottom rung of the experience educationally would be in public school. Public school, public school would be the worst depending and also depending on where you are because uh, obviously it, it's real bad it gets into some kind of um old school racism in the um wow. institutional racism correct in america which is obviously if you're more of an inner city kid yep. you're probably not going to have as good of an education as somebody correct. who's in a nicer neighborhood in public school correct both public schools one gets better Correct. teachers and textbooks and supplies and they actually tried to fix that when i was a kid with the busing system Ooh. so that they could get kids who lived in the lower areas bust into the nicer areas and that just was a cluster yeah. Yeah. garbage yeah. but we can relate to it in that way yeah. because in the public school system uh there is a whole lot that you're taught that you're never going to use ever. ever in your life ever. and a lot you need to know in life that they don't teach you absolutely and that whole thing about you're taught how to read a book about parachutes but not actually use one was spot on absolutely yep. very funny very let funny. us know more from him and other standard comedians that we can react to down below Just <laughs>